We do not conclude through reason that something is beautiful. Instead, we taste that it is beautiful. Aesthetics, the branch of philosophy that deals with beauty, art, and taste. It's like asking, what makes something look good, sound good, or feel good? And boy, do humans have a lot to say about it. While a rationalist might object to this by stating that there is a big difference between finding a meal excellent and finding a play to be excellent, the theory of taste states that a play is more complicated, and so it involves more cognitive work, which includes applying various concepts and principles. The ancient Greeks, Plato, Aristotle, and their philosopher Posse, were all about defining the essence of beauty. For them, it was all about balance, proportion, and that je ne sais quoi that made the Parthenon so darn alluring. One can go even further and claim that aesthetics are to objects as ethics are to people. Both are human and subjective assessments and thus mentally malleable with rhetoric and coercion. Both define identity and future possibilities. Kant said beauty was a matter of subjective judgment, not objective qualities. Hume argued that beauty was in the eye of the beholder, a product of our individual responses. Then the romantics showed up and suddenly it wasn't just about reason. Emotion, imagination, and the sublime were the new aesthetic power couples. In the modern era, things got even messier. The avant-garde said, screw your classical ideals, we're going abstract. Pop art declared, McDonald's is beautiful, fight me. And don't even get me started on the postmodernists. They'd probably just tell you there is no such thing as beauty, only power dynamics. The world became a stage, and we were all just players trying to capture that perfect insta shot. It's about understanding that what looks good to you might not do it for me. And that's perfectly okay. Aesthetics is less about finding the one true answer and more about embracing the glorious, messy, subjective nature of human perception. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.